Hello everyone, it's Olivia here, aka Story Minded, and I just wanted to make this video to say that I am officially going to university this September. I'm really excited, I'm going to be studying a BA in English and Creative Writing, and I'm just really excited for this like next part of my life, and I'm just really excited for the opportunity to learn in an area that I'm really passionate about and potentially after my three years of my degree I might go on to do a PGC um, in further education to become like a teacher um, but I also just wanted the opportunity to like explore different career options so while I'm at uni I'm also going to look into more on the writing side of things as well. I've really enjoyed my um, this year where I've been working as a fully qualified TA for the first time um, in a primary school setting I've really enjoyed it and once again that's given me the opportunity to work with children um, with a variety of needs that I've never really experienced before um, and I do enjoy it but I just want to try and push myself to do more and I'm just I'm really excited. <laughs> a part of me is also nervous, I think that's quite natural with people who go to university like I've been out of education technically for although I've done two apprenticeships obviously it's completely different to degree level and I've sort of been out of that student kind of mindset for like three years now so it's it's going to be a bit of a change <laughs> um I haven't written an essay in a long time writing I'll be fine with because obviously I write pretty much every single day but it's more like the essay side that I'm a bit like mm, I'm hoping that something will come back to me and I'll know how to do it but I know that there is support available and I'm just so lucky to have like my wonderful family that are really supporting me especially my mum so it's really good um I won't be living in halls or anything like that I'm going to my local university and um I couldn't afford to live away from home at this time in my life so I'm going to be staying home which which takes a bit of pressure off of things and I'm just really excited about where it's gonna hopefully lead. Um, I guess I'll just talk about the six modules that I've got for first year so there's um, I'm probably actually going to do some separate videos on this anyway but um, the titles of them are Literary Powers, the Renaissance to the Romanticism Movement, and um, there's Unpacking Text, which is an introduction to critical theory, um, but, but uh, the third one that I think is more to do with the English literature sort of side of it is um, Popular Culture, Spies, Dragons and Time Machines, and then for the three sort of I guess creative writing modules there's true stories which has a focus on autobi autobiographical write types of writing and creative non-fiction there's telling tales which is to do with like prose narrative and ballads and that kind of thing like the origin of tales and then there's tips tricks and techniques which I think focuses on like the ancient um techniques used in writing and stuff like that so like myths and legends and all that kind of thing so I'm, I'm really excited um, what I'm going to do probably in another video is I'm going to share um, some of the books that I've got um, for my course. Some of them I've done as like ebooks um, on my computer, so I won't be able to show all of them. But it'll be it'll be nice just to sort of share this. And I've also in a in my other video I did where I did a book recommendation video for. Bedtime stories for grown ups. I've um, completed my writing website, so I'm hoping during the course of my university, if I get time, which I probably won't, but I'm hoping to add to that website and I want to sort of document my university journey because I see a lot of people sort of do vlogs on that and I really enjoy watching them and I just really enjoy learning about other people's journeys with stuff they're passionate about. So if anyone wants to watch this, thank you and yeah. Bring on September. Bye.